hi guys welcome to my kitchen guys guys I'm gonna cook fish I'm gonna cook fish and I'm gonna take out some seasoning to go on my fish I'm using a little lemon pepper So let me show you the seasoning guys although you're supposed to know by this the seasoning that i use so i put a little lemon pepper i'm just i use not a lot guys i'm just putting a little of each just a little of each so lemon pepper a little seasoning salt just a little Look at garlic powder. Look at maggi, chicken seasoning. Look at paprika. Maggi fish seasoning. JCS fish seasoning, this Jamaican, Jamaican fish seasoning, Maggie, all purpose, just a little of each, complete seasoning, just a little, a little parsley. I'm gonna mix it up. Parsley is flashing all over my counter, guys, and my counter is clean, guys. A little cilantro. A little garlic pepper. As I said, just a little. So that means they must taste good, guys. Perfect seasoning, the perfect seasoning. Look a bit of adobo. Never have to use any adobo, but I use a pinch. Pass. All purpose, just like the maggi. And this is some fish seasoning. So mix up, mix up fish seasoning it have in salt, garlic, parsley, and spice. That's what it said. Okay, so I lick off everything. And guys, I have powdered ginger. I'm gonna tip a little bit in there, but I like to use my my blended ginger that I blend up. This, this this thing guys I always blend it full of ginger I buy the ginger at the the store that I buy the, the um the Korean store and I blend it up in my blender and I fold this so I have it to make drinks and I have it to put in whatever I'm doing and I have two more containers of ginger in my refrigerator guys but those two container they have in alcohol i use those two containers of ginger for baking so i tip a little of the ginger powder in there which is optional i didn't have to but i did so this is my seasoning guys this is my seasoning and i'm mixing it up yeah so i'm cooking fish so guys my fish is washed my fish is washed with lime and vinegar guys let me show you my fish this is my fish and this is perch 
these are perch and this is my seasoning and these are my seasoning that I cut up onion tomato scallion thyme garlic and scotch bonnet pepper so that's my seasoning guys and this is my fish and it's perch they are called perch so guys I'm gonna try my fish so I have to dry them and as I said I wash them with lime and vinegar and I give them I'm giving them two core and they don't core them too deep guys When I was a little girl, guys, growing up in Smithville, in Clarendon, Jamaica, West Indies, my papa, he used to go to the river at night with his friends, and they used to go torching. They call it torching at night. They go late night late night like after 12 something to 1 or so on or, 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 or 11 30 there about they go and he and my papa went with his friends my papa has a friend one of my papa friend is his name is eric eric brian his name is eric brian live in smithville in Clarendon so my papa and Eric Brian is best friend Eric Brian and, and papa that's my papa best friend and the papa said them his friend from them was a boy from them was a boy wearing short pants They are they was they are friends from there was a boy wearing short pants so that's a long time and him my papa and Eric Eric Brian we as children call him Mas Eric Mas Eric yeah so him and Mas Eric and some other friends one of them named Chappy one of them named Mas Chappy and some more friends they go to the river at night and they torching they call it torching they chop crawfish they chop um mullet they catch mullet and they catch perch they catch perch and they catch swims the same thing that you guys call caron is swims so they catch mullet, crawfish, lots of crawfish, and swims and perch. So I've been eating perch, and that um that it was river perch. I don't know where. The, probably these are sea perch. I buy them these at the fish store because I'm I'm living in America. So I buy this at the fish market. So I don't know if it's river or sea or mud, lake like when me, like some video when me watch on YouTube. I don't know where they come from. But anyway, they are perch. So my papa used to go torching at night at the river with his friend. So guys, I'm putting some seasoning in the fish. Yeah. And you have to, when you season your fish, guys, you got to make sure some go in the head. 
and put in some in the core that I made at the side. So my papa with his friends go make, um, they call it torching. They go to the river late night, walk the river. They walk a long way. They walk go out way down so, and they come back and they walk go way up so. Papa always said they go far. And then come back in the, the late hours of morning, like four, like three, four o'clock, there about in the morning. So that's my story on perch. My papa used to go do twitching at night. Catch perch and mullet and crawfish and swims. Anyway, so let's turn on the stove, guys. And I have some oil in the pot, guys. My papa um, friend, who is, who is Eric, Eric Brian, he has a brother living in Maypen. And he, uh, he, he was living in England. He, he's, he name, he, his name is Light Brian. And he told me that after my papa died, he told me that when my papa and Eric was a boy, we were in short pants growing up in Smithville. People, uh, they, they were so tight of a friend. They were so tight of a friend. People always said, he said that people always said, they gonna see which one of them gonna die first. That they was like so friend. From them was a boy wearing short pants. And there was a boy wearing short pants. And my papa died first. I saw um, Eric Bryan in 2011 when I went to Smithville to do a tombing match to do to tomb my mama. I saw Eric Bryan. And his wife named Adela Bryan. She comes from Moko. From um she comes from near to somewhere there near to Summerfield in Clarendon. Blackwood. She comes from Blackwood. Her name is Adela Bryan. She can cook. Oh my goodness. She can cook. And our food sweet, guys. Miss Adela Brand, food sweet. I'm telling you, man. And I didn't know that she died. It's when I went to Smithville 2011 to tow my mama. I, I heard that she died. If Miss Adela Bryan didn't die, if she was alive right now, guys, I would have make her so happy. Cause she used to treat me good. She used to, when I go by her, when my papa leave me by her, she used to, she was a good person to me. And if, she's, if she was alive now, I would have treat her good. Yep. Anyway, guys, that is part of the fridge opening up. The Kelvinator fridge, where they do our drop off, where we have to take your, what you do and push it on. Yeah, that is a part, that is a little of the fridge opening up. So, right now, may I lock the fridge and may I go fry the perch. Yeah. So guys, come with me to this stove because my oil is getting hot. I have some oil in the pot. And I 
season the perch guys i put seasoning in the core that i core two core at each side and i have seasoning in on the inside and guys you have to make so, sure some go down in the head and it was washed with lime and vinegar guys so find the perch So guys, we're gonna check the fish to see if it wants to turn. guys I'm gonna take my fish out now and I'm gonna do the seasoning and show you how I'm fixing up my fish it guys So I'm using the same oil that in the pot, pretty oil. Okay. So I'm putting the, the garlic first and the pepper. I always have to let me cough, guys, the pepper. Because it is so hot. I always let me cough. Put in the onion. In the stallion and the thyme. You have an idea what I'm doing yet, guys, with my fish. I'm doing brown stew fish, but I'm not putting any browning on it. I already brown it, so it's pretty. Fry it. So I'm putting the tomato now. Guys, I forgot the sweet pepper. I'm going to get the sweet pepper and cut it up. So guys, I get the sweet pepper. When I look in the pot, guys, I said to myself, oh, the pot not, oh, it, oh, it's not colorful. It only have the tomato for color and I said oh I forgot the sweet pepper but yeah and it was not late guys it was not late
So guys, I'm going to put my seasoning, the little seasoning that I have leave. Put it in there. put some water guys I'm gonna put my fish my hands are clean guys so I can hold them This is my fish, guys. Guys, I don't know if I'm holding the camera good, but I'm holding it. And I'm going to cover it. And I'm going to put some after I'm going to put some ketchup in there and you'll see it so guys we're going to check on the fish see you guys So guys, I'm going to put some walker's wood seasoning, a little walker's wood jerk seasoning in there. Okay, walker's wood. Put in some oyster sauce in there. And I'm putting some fish sauce in there, guys. This is the last of my fish sauce. Finish. Don't forget another one. And I'm gonna put the ketchup later. I'm gonna cover it back, guys. So guys, I'm going to put some ketchup in there. First, I'm going to sprinkle a little black pepper.
So guys, meanwhile my fish is cooking guys, I'm just making a little water to drink and I'm straining some ginger. Strain a little ginger. Strain it twice, and I'm gonna juice a lime, a lemon. Juice in a lemon, half a, half a lemon, and some ginger juice. So that's it, and then I'm going to pour some water. And this water, this water is for us to drink, guys. Ginger and lemon water. Ginger and lemon water for us to drink so when you put that in the refrigerator guys it is cool and nice and you have your ginger and your lemon water to drink no sugar added okay guys so we're gonna check on our fish guys looks amazing and my kitchen has smell amazingly awesome wow Putting some butter in there, guys. And it's almost ready. And guys, you know, fish don't take long for cook. When I easy me to cook. And that's fish. So guys, this is my finished dish. This is my fish. And this is stew fish, brown stew fish. From my kitchen to yours, guys. This is brown stew fish. And guys, please like, share the video, and subscribe to my channel, Marvel Most Blessed Jamaican Cooking. Thanks for watching me guys and you saw me make my glass jug of water with 
ginger and lemon my ginger and lemon water when it in the fridge guys it's nice and cool and I just throw out a glass and drink no sugar no sugar added guys plain water Thanks for watching me guys.